It's gonna be fun. Hopefully, I don't die 18 times again. Okay, maybe I didn't die 18 times. Did die a couple times, right? Could have been worse. Could have been bad. I hear myself. Can I hear myself? Oh hear yeah. <laughs> Alright, let's get this on. Alright, let's get this on. Alright, let's roll this. Alright, so get to fight that thing again. Come on. Oh, we trapped him in the one thing. Okay, that's good. He got trapped in there. We ran this way. Like I said, I slept since. The... Alright, um. Oh, that's right. We got our ass annihilated here last time we played this area. Hopefully. Yeah, good. They stay dead once you kill them. Okay. Got that. Alright. Let me, let me patch him. Got that. Switch him with X. So, anyone. Let people know. Except it is. Boom! Right, let's roll. Knock that over. She just runs the seven. Oh. Oh, let's get out of my way. Oh, what's this thing? Oh, you guys see it? I wouldn't have saw that if I didn't. Okay, so. Oh, yeah, we can get that. Oh. Oh. Got it. All right. Yeah, it's cool. Putting stuff in really cool places. I get it. I'm trying to hide something. Oh, that would have broke my leg. That was me. All right, so. What we got going on? Oh, see? That's crap. We did cleanse this area last time, I thought. Okay, we'll do it again. One moment. We've encountered heavy resistance. We've fallen back to the work department. All agents are ordered to converge here. Okay. I will in a minute. Let me read some stuff. This report serves as an introductory guide to the astronaut program, including candidates' requirements, training practices, and astro research procedures. Astronauts are chosen individuals who explore and document the astral plane by making physical contact with the X-ray light box. See blah 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 in the hypnosis lab section of the parapsychology division. Physical and psychological training is vital for the repeated transition between planes, known as dives. Each dive, astronauts must undergo a blank session in the cognitive recording chair to record their experience in the plane. Gathered data has conclusively proven that blank within the astral plane are very widely between astronauts. On rare occasions, these dives result in losses, often occurring when teams encounter aggressive astro entities. Ooh, this item. Mine. I'll take that. Yeah, ooh. Uh. Wait a minute. Ula Ty. Ula Ty. I can't even say the word. Utility. U U utilization of the paranatural elements. Yeah, I did it, guys. This study extends the work of. Irvin Janis, Robert Barron, and others by proposing strong casual links between group link and the passive or active use of telepathy. To prove these connections, the parapsychology department carried out variations of Solomon's as original conformity experiments using the telepathic individual as the subject. 
blank, blank, blank. Excellent quality, qualitative, quantitative. I can't even see that. Quantitative, I give you guys read the word. <laughs> Data resulting from these experiments was then used to identify telepathic interference within the group. Further empirical findings suggest measures can be taken to safeguard against telepathic influence or behaviors by engaging in. You know what I mean. You guys know what I'm talking about. Engaging in, you know. Rather boldly, this paper stands to revolutionize decades of groupthink theory and provide new directions for further experimentation on the mind, including manipulation of blank and blank. Cool. What's the multimedia one of this? What's that? An early oh. hypothesis was that the mindscape of the astral plane is subjective, but that was fast proven wrong. It, it's an actual place, not, not a construct of the mind, even though it is with our minds that we enter and experience. I already did that one, okay. Alright. Oh, let's go back and pick up a piece of a brain. Damn it. Take that! Lobe. Investigate the x ray light box object. What? I'm going this way, right? Because I. I'm confused. Let's do this first. Alright, zero missions. Dude, I'm. Uh, I guess we could go to the mail room real quick. I mean, these these are like. I, I'm gonna do those. I like doing those. They're fun. So, let's fast travel. Let's go to the mail room. Yeah, you guess certain quests you gotta do. I guess in a certain amount of minutes. I I, I mean, I died on one. <laughs> if you watch it, I got destroyed by like 1,800 of the his. This is the best part of the game, is this waiting right here. <sighs> waiting. All right, so where are we going? Sorry, dude. Sorry. I can't. How am I supposed to protect those guys from those things? There was no way they just blow up too quick. Okay, I suck. <laughs> don't, don't count on me to help you guys. I'll just get you killed. Sorry. Oh my gosh, I'm gonna only get them killed. That's a good, good person. I, I, I killed one on accident thinking, you know, these guys have armor. The explosions won't hurt them, but we are going to try to get this one. Uh, the X-ray light box object. Okay, Jesse learns of another. Oh, let's see if we can get that one, guys. Okay, let's see if we can actually get to this one. The other one we can't get to. So, um, fast travel. Uh, I think it's, let's go here. It's closer there, I think. It's it's it doesn't bother me to double check here. We're trying to find all the the lore and stuff, which is cool. The game is really fluid, though. I do like it. This part, yeah, maybe it's because my Xbox. Uh, it's not the older disc, but it's not the newest either. So.
What? Okay. Oh. Can I zoom in on this map? If I go back this way, that's the way back. We want to go this way. Sorry, I'm gonna turn the roof. It's kind of lost. Sorry, I'm not. There's this way. <laughs> Haven't I been here? I am so confused. Okay. Oh yeah, this is where you go up. Oh, so the door's finally open. There's that one. Oh, I can go either door now, guys. Okay. Let's check this door first. This is where that one item is. Oh, what is I see it. Going on? Another object of power? They're just standing there. Before I take that item, let's look around first. Alright. Back here. I yeah, I see it too, right? Maybe it opens up when you get the item? Maybe? I don't know. What we got? Okay. Ooh. I don't know what this is. I, I don't know what. Okay, we'll mess with that in a minute. Let's see if we can get the object of power. I'm gonna kill these guys. Not that guy. Can't open it. It's gonna be unlocked. Yes. Gotta unlock that to get to it. Can't get through it that way, so it's gotta be something to do with this. Lock here. This puzzle. Okay. Let's look at this again. This has got to be a puzzle. Must be like a. Oh, there it is. That's what I'm looking. That's it, right? That looks right. 
That one right there. Okay. Let's try that. Aha! Got it, guys. That one? Oh, Just gotta look around for this stuff. Found it, so. Oh, yeah, boy. Please state your name for the record. Paul Warren, astronaut, first class. And you are aware that exposure to the astral plane can result in death, disability, personal injury, corporeal entangling, cognitive collapse, loss of ego, and Jesus. dementia. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I am. And you acknowledge that your use of the astral conduit, aka the X-ray light box, is purely voluntary. <laughs> yes, I do. Perfect. Your suit is good. Okay, you're all set. Open the door for Mr. Warren, please. Oh my gosh. That's all you hear of him. Another ability. See, so she would like destroy Alan Wake because he, you mean? What? Golden copy? What is this? Golden enemies are used to find another way to defeat this enemy. Crap! What? Oh, I died. Sorry, guys. Cool. I can have people fight with me. That's a cool that's a ability. That's going to help a lot, though. Yeah, I'd say I like I die a lot in this game. Oh, almost did it again. Take that, Meanie. Oh crap!
Oh my god, she's like on 80 things like she has. She would slap the crap out of Alan Wake. Cool. This is a cool ability. You could like turn the. I don't know if you could turn them back. We got it. Their brains were fried when I took over the object. Hey right, guys. Sorry. Got that now. Okay. I don't think that's the way we're supposed to... I don't know if it is either, but we're checking regardless. This one. All right, so, um, darling here, some of you were curious why I had these sensory deprivation tanks installed. I thought I'd shed some light on this subject. Maybe some Tokyo, Tokihai, the man behind the hugely popular guide to imagery experiments tapes. Apparently, his tapes go beyond the normal meditative quantities of such scenes, but create genuine hallucinatory visions in some listeners, or so the reports say. We brought these tanks in to test Dr. Tokai's tapes for ourselves. Plus, there's uh, maybe some stress relieving uses for the staff down the road. I think we all better for some time in the dark and close space, don't you? <laughs> if you don't have any more questions, or if you do have any more questions, feel free to stop by my office. You know where it is. He p you piss him off, he goes, you're a test subject. <laughs> We got some new one of these. Ooh, okay. Oh, that's what we got. 20%. 23%. That one's junk. Uh, junk. 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 What's this one? Health recovery. No, what's this one? Energy recovery speed. No, I'll go with that. I'll try it. 11%. Junk. Junk. Oh, ooh. 30. That one is it. That just makes you all figure. This is the one we're chunking. Okay. We got some new gun stuff. Oh. That's the one we have on now. Chunk that one. Headshot damage. Don't worry about that. I can see damage after kills. Don't really worry about those. Those are all different. Okay, let's go to this one. This one's better. Some junk. This one. Damage. Uh, see, that's a good one. I like that one. Oh, I think it's a, it's a thug wall. We need a uh, more collectibles. When do I get more collectibles? Oh, it talks about the X-ray light box. Okay. Uh, the object is a light box used to examine X-ray images. The image can be removed from the light box. The information of the belongs to a patient named blank. The object allows I don't know that word is. Paralitarians to forcefully size an individual's mind. The seized individual becomes blank to the user. The effect lasts blank. Once released, seized as a result, you die as a result of the psychic trauma. The object has no current binder. A janitor named blank bound to the object at St. Anne's Hospital in blank. 
Soon the building's occupants were by him. It's to trigger the item, fill these number of the blank for operation details. Oh, so people actually died fighting that guy. That would be. I think that'd be cool. Just being these random agents getting these items. Research records. His clusters are unique in that they are concentrated manifestation of his residence on the host. His clusters are distinct. Then spherical compressions of his residence that serve support functions in the hierarchy of his entities. The clusters are, cl yeah, these are the things that were, um, this will hold the other creatures. Okay, we fought those earlier. They're paying the booty. What's this? Please one? state your name for the record. An astral mark first oh, we, we did this one. That one's good. We did that one. Some more research files. Uh, before using the record, recording device, place to ensure the following safety, ensure the volunteers really. I remember that one. We did that one earlier. Okay, have so far. So let's keep looking around. Maybe we'll find some more stuff. I tell you, truth, I'm kind of um, lost. Maybe I don't remember. Tokai. Dr. Ishime Japanese citizen reside in Tokyo has produced a series of guided imagery experiences. Auto recordings have gained notable popularity in Monkoba due to his unusual gift or usual unusual swift rise in fame, along with reports of vivid blank accompanying the use of his tapes. Investigators, sector staff were asked to look into his background. We found no past incident with an altered occurrence, nor any other evidence involvement with any altered organization. However, agents that attended a signing event reported blank when here in Tokai. Speak. We recommend that the research team obtain an audio recording of Tokai's voice and perform any and all relevant analysis. Based on the findings, the investigation tech will determine next steps regarding Tokai as well as his eligibility for prime candidate program. Oh, they'd be like a like a, a, a director. I mean, it makes sense. The, if they can handle, if they can handle that stuff. I'd be the ones to pick. Like Alan Wake could be a, a I think. Oh my gosh! Don't break anything. To break everything. Alright, let's go in here. Um, we didn't go this way yet. I know what these are. It's recording. Okay. Okay, so now, okay, now we can go on to game. Now we can control God, that's going to help us a lot in fighting enemies. Mm, where are we going? Let's go here, see if I can do any extra little quests. One oh, we've got some abilities, let's make sure we get those hooked up. Um, Try everything. Oh, what? Oh, yeah, that's right. <laughs> See if there's any easy ones. You are needed, irreplaceable. <laughs> I keep dying, so it doesn't matter. <laughs> Got a lot of those points. Maybe we can do another mode. Not yet. There. Okay. See if I could not die for two seconds. Where's the elevator? Anyone see it? I think it rains. All that lovely stuff. Where's the elevator? Ah, the elevator. Okay, let's see what's going on here. Marshall, can you hear me? Yes, I can hear you. Who is this? My name is Jesse Faden. I'm coming to help. Faden? 
Hold on. I'm sending the elevator for you. We need to talk. Right. She got that right, bro. More of you? Really? My bad. I was, I was trying, hoping you can like. All right, pwned. Well, get better next time. <laughs> I, I'll never get that quest. I'll never get, because I keep dying. It's a lovely waiting scream. The last bad guy in the game is going to be the blob. Alright, let's do this again. <laughs> After I failed so horribly. I'm not talking to her. Oh. Oh, let's go see, check this other stuff. For, oh, okay. I see what this is. I skipped died. Marshall, can you hear me? Yes, I can hear you. Who is this? My name is Jesse Faden. I'm coming to help. Faden? Hold on. I'm sending the elevator for you. We need a talk. You got that right. Got that right, bruh. I'm gonna, I'm gonna eat chicken More nuggets. Of you? Really? I'm not fucking around now. I'm not bad. There we are. Your mind goes. This is so cool. I can turn on my side, guys. I love it. All right. We be all on the same team now, boys and girls. Yeah. So does that make you human again? Oh. Oh my god, oh, that's right, it kills him after a while, that's right, okay. <laughs> Alright, let's do it. Ooh, what's up, people? Marshall is right down the hall. Marshall's like, down the hall. Take a ba bathroom break. Oh, there we go. Oh, is there a mirror? No mirrors. What's up with no mirror? Oh, it's probably. Oh, they probably didn't want mirrors. Oh, what happened in here? Ooh. Is there another? Discover. Oh my God. <laughs> Just. <laughs> Discover in the home of an agent after his young daughter complained about being followed by her rubber duck, according to the agent. We don't know who it is, Blank. The matter was ignored, believed to be a result of a child's imagination, until he began to hear the quacking at night. After discovering the item hiding in his daughter's closet, he brought it to the bureau for first day. It was discovered that Agent Blank was bringing known paranatural materials into his home, illegally taking them outside the oldest house. How this may have affected creation with the altar mind is being investigated. Oh, he's been terminated. When they say terminated, do you mean like they, they killed him? It seems like it's beyond them. You know, it's a good thing he's terminated because he ain't here no more. She's just down the hall. Can I climb? Oh. oh, boy, man. Probably, is there anything up in the trees? I the trees. I was gonna jump too. I was like, ooh. Check this. Gotta check everything because you know, always some high games. <laughs> 
Okay, nothing. I don't see anything. Nothing up there, okay. Marshall is waiting for Oh my gosh. Ooh, save time. Oh, excuse me. Taking this plant. Never know when you might need it. There you are. I was starting to worry. Talk to you in a minute. I got better things to do. Talk to you right now. <gasps> Ooh. It's the good luck kitty. Meow meow. What? Oh, I'm afraid to do that after I got everyone killed last time. Let me check, check to see if there's anything extra. What's that mean? Does that mean bad luck? We're putting it down. It's going down. It's happening. <laughs> That's funny. Alright. And she looks sharp. Relations and your appointment, Director Phaeton. I'm Helen Marshall, head of Bureau Operations. Zachariah's dead then, and I assume you found his gun. Just call me Jesse. Trench told me to find you. He said you could help. And he told you this through the hotline. Makes sense. None of this phases her? Really? Here's the situation. Darling created the HRAs in a lab nearby. We need more if we're gonna survive this attack. My rangers can't secure the lab alone, not against those things. We need more firepower. At least she seems to know what's going on here. She could know about Dylan. I can clear out the hiss. I'll be your firepower. That's a good answer. Is she testing me? Darling has systems in place to protect his labs. This should help you get past them. We'll talk more after you clear out the hiss. Rangers, let her through. We'll have to lock the door behind you. Sorry, but we can't risk a breach. What'd she give me, like? She, like, give me a... I only got clearance level three, okay. I can't get that one yet. I tried. So we're going to do these. We're still doing that one. Okay. So we're going through here. Okay, cool. What is going on? Oh, crap! I see where you're over there. We have to help them.
it at? One fucking guy. Come on, I gotta keep this one guy alive. Why did you kill yourself? Where's it at? There it is. Come on, bro. That was doing so well. Gosh. I wonder if they kill all those guys again. Almost there. Almost there. Oh, do I go talk to her again? Uh, I take this plan. We never thought we'd be fighting on our own turf. Seriously, the threshold safer than this. Let's do this again. This one. Kill that one. So I just your baddie guy again. At least they're full health. again. Whoop this guy's ass. Here, this guy. Here. Freaking head! Oh, 
Crap! Can you get away from me, Jack? You guys just wait. Imagine just dying right there. Nice. Here we go. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. All right. So we got um, the nap probably. So check it. Over here. There's some good stuff in here. Sometimes there is it. Uh, oh, my bad. Uh, initiative proposal: The Threshold Kids. Uh, with the re recent revival uh, arrival of Blank, there are certain glaring gaps in the Bureau's ability to educate and raise the young. There's no other blank for blank to play with, and blank is expected to learn about a frightening new concepts. Will require a slow, friendly introduction to paranatural topics. With this in mind, allow me to introduce the Threshold Kids, a television show in which cast of cheerful puppets, they're not, they're not cheerful at all, explain the dangers of living at the Bureau, but also show the fun side of paranatural. Budget will be minimal. I took a few puppet making courses at my local center. We can have our church staff build the sets, record the footage, and even do voices. It'll be good for morale, and I guarantee we'll enjoy a positive to these videos. We can't expect a blank to enjoy lectures. People in Lab Coast best have a vision that's proven for years. Love puppets. Whatever, man. I think that threshold kids is creepy. Something up here, if I'm not mistaken. See if we can go to this. Up here, okay, cool. Oh my gosh, what happened here? evil guys. He was a synth from Fallout. I for you. Surprisingly, this go to. What? Oh, well that now. Let's check up here real quick. Red roll, bureau, yeah, obviously this, this place is. Okay. Global synchronicity. Wow, I actually said that. As a test, television sets were placed in a variety of locations around the world, world inside rooms identical, identically decorated. A hypothesis was that by identically altering the decor of every room and then char changing the channel in every room but one, that the single deferring television would spontaneously align the incoming frequency to match its synchronized counterparts. 
The experiment seemed like a failure until it was observed that the agents responsible for arranging the Mondre these rooms were all experiencing the same emotional turmoil as one clinical depressed member of the team himself being located in the eastern part of blank. Psychological exam examination aids to prove the correlation. Interesting, the phenomenon of synchronicity did occur, but not in the way we predicted. Cool, cool bro. Cool, man. No. supposed to go so what's over here ritual office okay, so we check the office out This one's called, uh, thank you for the file, it was helpful. I re-archived it with the Black Rock research in case you need to refer to them again. Yes, the video shoots are always interesting. I expect my availability for those to decrease in the future. However, as my ana analysis of this newly discovered Black Rock variant is reaching a critical point, I hope you'll be able to attend them still. Darling seems to be under a lot of pressure lately. I'm sure he'd appreciate any support you can provide. Regarding the analysis you provide, I do not have any questions. Dr. Carla Vaughn. Anything good? Anything juicy? Something juicy in there. Let's go check it out. What's this? Ritual. This one's called Rituals. Um, obsessive compulsive disorder, hoarding, and anxiety disorders. by certain manifestation is simple result. Mental illness sometimes in simply performing rituals. There's something called rituals. The blank of the rituals can vary. Pneumology, dream logic, forfeiture, verbal, formality, repetitive action, casual, death theory, or just some, some rituals consistent with so the light switch court three times, then turn tell, but some are erratic. While most people engage in minor rituals every day, the vast majority do not understand the importance behind their actions. Avoiding disaster, messing up, or simply equating lust, these are all results of daily rituals. Individuals who recognize the deep remain behind these compulsive actions are highly aware of the prenatural world and then locate when located should be considered employment. Oh, so they want these people. That is cool. That's smart too, because it's not, hey dude, we know you're this stuff, please join us. Yeah, they would have loved out. Where is this? Oh, that's a nice office. Okay. Oh. Not all I can find in here. Time to go back. I'm gonna run back. We found all we can find up there. Which way's the lab? We won't go that way first. 
That's the way to the lab, so let's go everywhere else. Oh, let's not go that way yet. Let's go everywhere else. Altered item number 52AE announced. Okay, guys! I will begin by introducing various stimuli to the item. First, a low voltage electric shock. No response. Next, I will introduce heat via a standard Bunsen burner. Oh my god. <laughs> oh god. No response. Next, a series of solutions will be applied, each with a different value on the pH scale, from 0 to 14. The burn is this thing? What? No response to any value. Next, I will attempt to communicate. Can you understand me? Can you understand my words? Quack, if you can understand my words. No response. This concludes session two. We'll need time to prepare further tests. Dude, can I get this item? I want the rubber ducky. Oh, rubber ducky. Let's be here. Rubber ducky, so fine. Oh, rubber ducky. Want the rubber ducky? Maybe next time. Maybe there's a door or something. Open this door. Ooh, item. There. Talked about there. Okay. That's the rubber. Yeah, that's cool. That's the rubber ducky they talked about. We talked about earlier. That's the way they go, so we're trying to go at ways not to go, so it's this right here. There's nothing else, it's just a rubber ducky. Maybe it will open up. This way to the lab? Okay. You must like these HRAs. Sounds like Darling built them. And most of the things around here. If Marshall can't help us with Dylan, he's our next best bet. Assuming he's not dead or taken over by the hiss. Someone, someone betrayed someone. That's for sure. I can tell. It was either your brother's. You probably, your, your brother's probably the bad guy, though. Because if someone kept me in captivity for a long time, I'd be a little pissed off. Get out of here. Rubber ducky? Rubber ducky, you're the one. What? Oh man. Oh, well, at least we get, I guess we get something. This went like all for nothing, you know what I mean? That's really all there was over here? Oh, you guys see it, don't you? How are you over there? Way. See, you must get like some type of item or something that lets you like jump stuff like that. There's just no way I can get up there. There's a lot of stuff in here. What's that over there? Like, there's a lot of stuff. Here, HRA lab. Any idea how to make it work?
Black rock prisms are unique formations of black rock, distinct in both their shape and potency. Potency, potency. I can't even see the word. While the destiny of the black rock dampens paranatural forces, the unique blank structure of the prism retains frequency in the range of blank to blank hertz with perfect blank harmonization. The poor analysis of the results of focusing a blank through a harmonized prism onto a blank methods for the imprinting of a non-physical fields onto blank, imbuing the properties of harmonized resonance blank in the prism will be explored and explained. Refer to file blank for blah, 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 blah. Hello again, Director. It appears we have a new problem. We need to get the HRA machine working. I've replaced a couple of spark plugs, but this looks a bit more complicated. Darling must have had a system. Randomness isn't in his nature. The punch cards, the symbols, the terminals. How do they connect? I'll see what I can do. Punch cards, cool. What's upstairs? Let's check upstairs, maybe there's something good up there. Ooh, cart. She was looking at it weird camera. Uh, guys, I'll be back. I gotta go.